Hey what's going on guys my name is Ravi and welcome back to another Adobe After Effects tutorial from Era FX So in this video we'll be learning to make this cylindrical text animation in a very simple and easy way So I'll first create a new composition I'll name this cylindrical text 1920 by 1080 resolution is fine with a duration of around 10 seconds and I'll hit okay. So now the first thing is to create a text layer. To do that, I'll click on this T button here so that will enable the type tool and I'll type in some random text. I'll type in cylindrical text effect and I'll use the align window here to center this. And now I'll right click on this text layer and hit pre compose i'll hit okay so now i'll change the height of this pre composed layer to do that i'll go to composition and from composition settings i'll change the height to something like this so that it fits exactly like this and i'll hit okay i'll go back to the cylindrical text composition i'll select the layer i'll tap P on my keyboard so that I'll enable the position parameter. I'll click on this timer button here so that a keyframe is created at the first frame. I'll move this towards the left something like this. And I'll go to the last frame of my timeline and I'll move this towards the right so that it moves outside of our composition window. Now, I'll go to the effects and presets window here. If you don't find this panel simply go to window and ensure that fx and presets is checked so from this panel here i'll type in motion tile so you have this motion tile effect in the stylize folder and i'll drag this on to our layer and now i'll increase the output width to around 500 and i'll also increase the output height so that it covers the entire composition also i'll check this horizontal face shift button and i'll hold alt on my keyboard and click on this timer button here for face so that an expression editor opens up and i'll type in time into 40 all right and now i'll right click on this layer and hit pre compose i'll not open this in a new composition and hit okay so now i'll go to the effects panel and add another effect called cc cylinder so you have this cc cylinder in the perspective folder and i'll drag this onto our layer and i'll change the render from full to outside and i'll also add the final effect called glow and i'll drag this glow effect onto our layer once you do that you can simply tweak some values here and there you go So if I start playing the video you can see that we have this sort of cylindrical text effect and that is what we need. You can always increase the radius of the cylinder just in case if you want to increase or decrease the radius. I hope you found this video helpful and if that's the case give us a thumbs up and if you'd like to talk with me regarding visual effects you can always reach out to me on Instagram at @vfxkairavi. See you guys next time with another tutorial.